Hello. Um, if you guys don't know me, I'm Tasmanian Pete. And if you hear meowing, I got a cat. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video about how I've been doing. Um, I've decided to start making videos about how I'm feeling and just kind of like personally blogging it for personal reasons. I like to, I, I don't really have a good memory so I try to remember as often as I can so I make videos. Um, so I guess I'll just get into it. I've kind of been like in a fog for a little bit. I haven't really been doing good mentally. Um, it goes in and out, but it's been really hard recently because I'll go to work and then I'll come back home and I'll drive back in like silence. And it's just so weird because when I'm socializing with people, or like with my coworkers or like just in general, I can talk to them and, you know, be normal and then I get in my car by myself again and it's like, none of my songs are feeling good right now, none of my songs are feeling good, I can't watch like podcasts, I don't want to hear anybody talk, I kind of just want to be in silence and like, even my car is too loud, I don't like being in a loud car because I just feel like I need like straight silence. Um, and I've gotten myself into a situation that is not very good for me either, and I probably shouldn't be in it, but honestly, like, it, it just makes me, it makes me sad because I know I shouldn't be in this type of situation because it always makes me feel this way, but it, it's like you really really want something and you know that what you want is not going to come out of this situation but you have like a little sliver of hope that what you want will even though you know the chances of it coming out of the situations are very slim um, and I worked so hard on being the current person that I am that it kind of feels like a slap to my face like you've went through all this work and you've done all of this just to slip back into your old habits and I don't want to slip back into my old habits but I am and I've been really irresponsible with my life recently um a lot has happened to me in the last month and I really don't I never thought that I would end up in this situation but alas I have um, I actually learned recently that people with BPD tend to get in trouble with like stuff that I've gone through and it's happened um, it's because I'm like forgetful and stuff and I don't really I can't it's it's hard for me to explain but um because I don't want to say something and then it sounds like oh she's this and that it's just literally because I have a bad memory and I have like like quite literally a condition that has it but um and I don't really even like it's so hard I can't I feel like it's just, I've been going through so much, and I can't, and I can't, I feel like I can't fix anything right now. And I haven't been feeling very pretty lately. Like, I love myself, and I, and I am my number one fan, but recently I have not been feeling like an it girl. I've been feeling like a monster. And I know that I've... I'm the only one that can see most of my insecurities, but it's just, that that's just how it's been for like the
couple of weeks that I've been around. Um, and I also wanted to talk about selfishness and like selflessness because I've been encountering a lot of people that'll do stuff and it just seems so selfish and I sit there and I look at it in a state of awe like how can you how can you see somebody that cares so much and use that against them or you see somebody that is at their wits end and you use that against them it doesn't make any sense to me you see obviously a hurt person and you take what they've been through and you use it for yourself that's like serial killer behavior I don't understand why people do that and I've just I've just been not doing very good I got a cat though so I come home to this lover boy and he restores my faith in a lot of things. I love him so much because he's really amazing and he's probably the best thing that's happened to me in a while. Besides my three ferrets, I love them too. Toxin is amazing. Drax is a great older brother. Riot likes to bite, but she's special too. I love her. And but my baby Bagheera is always cuddling me when I get back. So it really makes me feel good about myself. Um, I've met some pretty cool people recently as well. And although meeting cool people it's fun, I always come back to my room and in my house and I'm like, yeah, they're cool, but I don't think we could anything could ever happen between us because I am very inconsistent with people and. I'm trying to get better at it, but I just don't feel like anybody has any interest in me or anybody can be interested in me because I'm low-key, like, kind of boring. <laughs> but I just, I don't know. But, yeah. I've been trying to figure out some answers as to why I've been feeling this way, but every time I try to figure out why, I've just been walking in circles, which is why my brain has been in a fog. Like this video probably doesn't even make any sense because I keep walking in circles, but I have a cat, so say hi. Hey little mittens, he got mittens what but yeah um thanks for watching if you did i will see you when i have my next mental breakdown probably i don't really he just bit me uh-uh